What essentially is a good and creative piece of copywriting will always be subjective based on the target audience. But there are eight universal elements that one can follow in their pursuit of being an excellent copywriter. Number one, clarity and relevance. A good copy should be clear, easy to read and understandable with an apt message for the readers at the end. There's a general myth about copywriting that good copywriters need to know fancy Sashi Tharoor English to be good at what they do. But in reality, it's the exact opposite. If you can market your product or service with simplicity and clarity that can resonate with your target audience, you are good at what you do. Using technical jargon isn't that much appreciated in the industry. One pro tip would be to write like you talk. Write in a conversational tone, keeping your target audience in mind and make them included by addressing their pain points or concerns. And that's how you gain clarity and relevance in your industry. Also, most importantly, offer them a solution in the CTA which I'll discuss in point number seven, so don't miss that. Number two, benefits over features. Instead of focusing solely on the features of a product or service, effective copywriting emphasizes the benefits to the consumer. How will your product or service improve their life, solve their problems or fulfill their desires? For example, if I have to talk about the features of this mic, I would say, well, this is a condenser mic and it has XYZ features, but that may not be relevant for the buyer. On the other hand, if I focus on the benefits, it instantly becomes more appealing. For instance, if I say, do you want to make sure your voice sounds clear, authoritative and also ring a bell of clarity to your audience? Well, look no further than this Mauno mic as not only this will make you sound like a professional during your Zoom calls or YouTube videos, but it won't even burn a hole in your pocket. Elevate your audio quality to the next level by getting this mic today at only 2,900 rupees. By the way, this is not a sponsored video, just giving an example. Number three, understanding your audience. A good copywriter should always have a solid understanding of his target audience. What are their needs, desires, wants, pain points, and how they can be addressed using effective copywriting is a skill that's a must have for any budding copywriters. For instance, you can't sell a luxury car to someone who's just in college or sell a copywriting or freelancing course to the viewers of my YouTube channel as they'll find everything for free here. <laughs> Subscribe for more upcoming videos on copywriting. So in essence, finding the product market fit is crucial and understanding your audience becomes key here. Number four, emotional appeal. Every good copy should have an emotional appeal attached to it that triggers the target audience to take a specific action or resonate with what they're offering. Understanding human psychology and consumer behavior becomes key here to create a compelling copy that hits the emotional spectrum of the consumer, which ultimately leads to conversions. Make them feel connected or included with your copy and that's how you build a loyal audience and boost more sales. One great example of this would be Black Friday sales or Amazon or Mintra year-end sales where they trick the consumer by showing that they are offering huge discounts like 50 to 70 percent off with a message that seems irresistible for the shoppers. Number five, brand voice. Every brand on the planet has a distinct voice and effective copywriting plays a vital role in that. The copy should be written in a voice that is consistent with the brand's offerings, making it easily recognizable in their community. It can be formal, casual or personal or a mix of many types, but it should be a distinct one that stands out among the competitors of the same industry and become synonymous with the brand. For example, Gucci and LV will have the brand voice of selling luxury, legacy and exclusivity. Nike's brand voice will be motivational or becoming a better version of yourself, etc. Number six, compelling headlines. A clickworthy headline is the most important part of a copy as it's the first thing the readers will notice and it needs to be enticing enough to grab their attention, to hook them to keep reading. A compelling headline should be clear, concise and relevant to the audience audience and also offer them a benefit or solution at the end. Pro tip, invest a lot of time in crafting the hook of the copy before you work on the body. Remember, if the hook is not enticing enough, no one will read the body and it won't matter even if the content inside is gold. Hence, compelling headlines are of paramount importance. For instance, think of the headline as the title and thumbnail of any YouTube video. If the title or thumbnail does not compel anyone to click, then it won't matter even if you have made a killer video with awesome editing or storytelling. 
no one will watch number 7 cta or call to action any good copy is incomplete without a clear and compelling cta at the end that encourages the audience to take some specific action after reading or consuming the content whether it's buy now or follow or sign up your cta should be direct and action oriented after you have provided value to the consumers oh by the way if you found this video helpful till now please feel free to like it and subscribe to my channel for more educational videos see that was a call to action where i urged my viewers you watching in this case to take a specific action which is to subscribe don't add your cta at the very beginning of your content as you need to gain the trust and credibility first also a pro tip don't bombard your audience with multiple call to actions which can be overwhelming and confusing to the consumers which ultimately won't lead to any conversion Remember quality over quantity. Number 8 persuasive language. A good copy should always be persuasive, meaning it should influence or persuade the reader to take a particular action after reading it. A good copywriter uses various elements of storytelling, human psychology, anecdotes, emotions, data, or social proof to convince the audience to take that particular action if a piece of copy can't evoke any feeling or emotion after reading it then it has failed its purpose hence it's a necessity in every piece of copy if you follow all the elements mentioned in the video in your copywriting journey you will have a crisp clear and impactful copy that can generate revenue and gain a loyal audience if you want to learn more check out this video where i shared the beginner's guide to copywriting in 2024 in under 8 minutes thank you for watching i am anirban and i'll see you at the next one cheers